What are you doing? Looking for intruders. Ouch. Which includes you. Whatever. Red Rocket. It's Hunter. Red the Hunter. Imbecile. What the hell? Hmm. Unit Y. Where are your compatriots? Unit Y? What's that? Sorry. You're the rookie. Don't tell him a single thing. Oh, in that case, Red's over there. You little skunk. Ah, wonderful. About 69 feet behind you have in a nice little tan. Hmm. Uh, unfortunate. No idea where the blue guy's been. That's too bad. Why aren't you willing to turn over your friends? Friends? I hate those guys. You're doing me a favor, honestly. Interesting. Make note of that, Alana. Yes, sir. You'll all come with us. We're going to find your blue friend and then we're going to get you situated for your next mission. Next mission? There was a first. What's going on? Are we leaving? You asked too many questions, Goldenrod. Goldenrod? Hello, are you going to join me or what? Oh, ah, uh, yes sir! Yellow, now! Well, fuck. Ugh, what happened? Wait a minute, why do I sound weird? They changed it so it'd be more obvious to Spartans that we're robots. We're robots? Yeah, I didn't believe it either. Well, that's some bullshit. No wonder those soldiers got me so easily. So what is this place? The UNFC Cosmo. We are heading to our first gig. First gig? They are sending us to war. I'm not happy about it. Oh yes. Finally, a worthy opponent. Says the guy who barely got any kills. Shut your goddamn mouth. You couldn't even kill me. And my guard was down. Don't test me. Green Bean. Yes, for the hundredth time, I formally accepted your and your comrades' application to the Spartan 4 program. You're welcome. Oh my goodness. Wow! Th that's so exciting, thank you! I can't wait to tell my captain. They don't care. Lieutenant Alano Reynolds will be there to pick you up tomorrow. Never call me again. Goodbye. Why did you lie to him? It's funnier if he thinks he's going to matter in life while actually becoming even more disposable than he already was. His pain pleases me. That's pretty fucked up. Whatever, just go get a pelican and take them to the coordinates that the Trinity woman gave you. Fuck's sake. <sighs> on it, sir. Um, Commander? Ah, my favorite Spartan, Louie. What can I do for you? The robots are awake. Finally, let's go say hello. So, when the hell are we gonna get to shoot things? I don't know, but I'm getting impatient. I really need to kill something with my bare hands. You guys are sick in the head. Commander on deck, so shut up and pay attention. Thank you, Louie. Anytime, Ignacio. Red, green, yellow, blue, pink. I'm sending you all with Louie here on a mission to the planet Falupi, where we believe there's been a minor flood outbreak. Flood? Didn't we wipe those out years ago? You did nothing. Let's remember that. And yes, the sinkhole was thought to be dead. But this is the flood we're talking about. Who knows what's happening? What can we do? Because of your robotic nature, there is no risk to you becoming infected upon arrival. So your job is to eliminate the flood. Louis here will guide you there from your landing point. Well, I'm sold. Let's get those flood bastards. Excellent. Good luck. Did he just hit the eject button? Oh shit. Hmm. Quite odd. This place looks deserted. Well, they did say the flood was out here, so maybe everyone died? That doesn't make any sense. The flood are basically zombies. They'd be a dead hobbling around or whatever. How do you know so much? I like to read in my spare time. Unlike you guys, I actually do things besides shoot people. Hey, I have hobbies. Boiling yourself isn't a hobby. It's just weird. Uh, shut up. Could you all shut up a little? We need to keep a low profile. Who knows what's going on? Whatever it is, it ain't good. Roger, Dodger. All right, we're gonna divide and conquer. Green and yellow, I want you two to sneak around the, through the large hole on the side of the entrance. Blue and pink, stick with me as we go through the main gate. And what about me? You have the most important job of all, Red. 
Keep your eye on our backs to, from a secure location. If things get hairy, it'll be good to have a sniper on guard. Camera, finally someone appreciates my sniping. Now come on, robots roll out. We can't say that, that's a trademark. Uh, these idiots don't look very zombie-like to me. Yeah, my interface is telling me they were stabbed, one in the stomach and the other in the chest. They must have bled to death. Sucks to suck. Let's keep moving. All right. We've been set up. What? I said, we've been- <gasps> Oh shit. What's stopping? We heard your fire. Yeah. Are you guys fighting without me? We got ambushed. Where the fuck is Red? He's supposed to be backing us up. Corvus, this is real. We've been discovered. I'm aware of the situation. We shall be making our departure within the day. Understood, General. I shall prepare the Banshees. We should leave. How? We don't have a ride. They said Banshees. We gotta assume that's some kind of vehicle, right? So what? We just sneak in somehow? Exactly. Follow my lead. Deviant. Well, son of a bitch is asshole. O'Brien, have you come up with an actual plan yet? Jones, I don't appreciate your rest <gasps> Oh shit! Bail! Oh, you've got to be kidding me! And after that, you guys showed up! Fascinating. So the soldiers here didn't put up much of a fight at all? Nope. It was pretty easy to take control of the base. Humans aren't exactly the most intelligent creatures when it comes to self-defense. Gan, where am I? Where's my sniper rifle? Calm down, you're in prison. Oh god, we're back on the Cosmo. No, we're being held captive by the Covenant. We're not the Covenant! To hell with the Covenant! We are members of the Damned, a revolutionary organization intent on ending human supremacy in the Outer Rim. <laughs> Tomato Tomato, you guys have the same mission. Untrue! We plan to awaken Starbreaker, the forerunner goddess who will bring salvation to all creatures in the galaxy. Excluding humans, of course. So why haven't you killed us yet? Yeah, isn't keeping us alive a little counterproductive? Not that I want to die, of course. I'm down for whatever. General Corvus has a pitch for you. She's right. You see, you five do not qualify as humans. In fact, you are quite the opposite. You are considered artificial intelligence. Sounds fancy. Don't get too cocky. You're still considered dumb artificial intelligence. So I would like to pitch to you the concept of working under us, instead of the humans you served up until this point. It is clear they were using you for cannon fodder under the false belief that the Flood were here. With your Spartan comrade now dead, I hope your decision will not be influenced by his presence. Are you not a human? Excuse me? <laughs> what happened to the Banshees? <laughs> that will have to do. This is your last chance, droids. Join us in our conquest, or be left here to rot. Your choice. Sure, I'll join you, but on the condition that I get my sniper back. Considering we'll probably be deactivated, if we go back for letting Moon we die, I'm down. As long as I can still kill stuff, I'm all in. Him. I should probably mention that my helmet has been sending video logs to our commanding officer every hour. Your helmet is doing what? Well you see, just before this mission, I got an upgrade that gave me an active camera that sends footage of everything I see and hear back to the UN- Ha! Ah, Jabez! See you never, blue balls! Does anyone else have upgrades we should know about? Don't think so. Good. Then follow me. Wait a minute, weren't there three of you split jaws when you jumped me? It's because we couldn't have nine characters on screen at one time earlier, so he got the chopping block for being dead weight. 
Don't feel sad. He should be thankful we even bothered naming him at all. Alright. Cause ain't real, you take the tank while I take the pink robot on the mongoose. The rest of you I trust to follow us in the jeep. <clears throat> Good. Let's move. Oh fuck! <laughs> I think that's a sign to speed the fuck up. Already ahead of you. Ah, uh, god damn it. Wow, you missed two of them. Are you sure you were the best in your unit? It's not my fault. It's just that the constant stench of milk emanating from your body was distracting me. Uh-huh, keep telling yourself that. Oh, what do we have? <gasps> oh, come here to daddy. Get off of that stinky winky body and come to papa. Before you, I was a god. With you, I am now aesthetically complete. And still very much so a god. Ah, <sighs> wow, that's so much better. Anyways, what am I here for again? Why are you asking me? I don't care. Oh, that's right, I was blowing the fuck out of this joint to keep pissing that Trinity woman off. See, I didn't need you anyways, idiot. Whatever. And kaboom, dickhead. Was that really necessary? <laughs> I don't know, was it necessary to start recruiting for soldiers in old folks' homes? But yet you're here, right? Sir, we just lost another outpost that was scheduled to become a Trinity satellite. Let me guess. Outpost high ground? Unfortunately, yes. It was a disaster. How so? What happened to Louie? We lost contact with him completely. But we did get a last minute transmission from the blue robot sent with him, which helps us narrow down the culprit. I'm guessing it's not the Flood. Negative. It appears to have been a Covenant splinter group calling themselves the Damned. No idea what their intentions were. But going from the robot's video logs, it appears they carry a similar disdain for humans as their predecessors. Some things never change, I guess. Enlightening. Anything else to report? Hopefully some kind of good news? Yes, but sadly, it's not much better. Fine. Just rip it off like a band-aid then. We've lost contact with Alanis Pelican as well. No sign of the guards from Outpost Blackout. It appears communications were severed mid-flight. <sighs> You think this has anything to do with the incidents at Rat's Nest? It's unclear at this time, sir. But, I have my best guys looking into the case. Alright. Thank you, Randy. You may return to your post now. Of course, sir. Well, this just fucking sucks. <laughs>